everyone. Thank you so much for checking out Crafty Little Rosebud here on YouTube. Today we are going to lay out some kits and pages for the entire month of May. Um, I'm going to do it similar to what I did last month where I show you the kits, tell you the shops, link them below, um, take a break, lay out my kits, and come back and show you what I've done. But I really want to get back into actually doing plan with me's on these, not just laying out kits. So I think once I get all these laid out, I'll come back and lay out like my chore stickers and plans and different things like that as well. So let me show you the kits and then um, I'll cut away, get everything laid out, laid out and come back. So I've got this page here from Brandy's shop. This is another page from her shop that kind of matches those full boxes. And then I had these leftovers from Cactus Paper Co. And I thought that I could use some of these to potentially tie in. So that will be for the week of April 29th through May 5th. Then for the 6th through the 12th, I've got these boxes here from Crafts by Towie. And they are foiled. I've got these Mother's Day boxes from Brandy Shop and then this washi and headers page from Brandy Shop. Then the following week I've got this micro kit from Plush Paperies and these little functional bars from Scribble Prints Co. And I'm not sure if I'll use these or not, but I wanted to grab them just in case. And then I'm actually only going to do four weeks of May. Um, I've got this set here from Design Ski Sticker Co. We've got our washi, habit trackers, and headers, and then some full boxes. And then I pulled these little extras from a Megan Renee plans kit that I used. And um, I figured some of these might tie in if I need them. And then there is one more week in this, but I'm actually gonna hold off and I'll do this in June. So let me get all that laid out and then we'll come back, I'll show you and we'll kind of throw in events and chores and stuff like that. Okay, so um, I did not get to finish laying all the stickers out last night. Um, I got busy with my daughter, so I went ahead and finished laying them out today and I'm just showing you all how I laid the kits out and then we're gonna lay out a few stickers here. Um, it's not a full-blown plan with me like I want to get back into, but once my school lets out, so probably come July, I'm going to start trying to do those a little bit more. So here is the kit I used. Um, it actually wasn't a kit. It was just two pages from Brandy Shop, and I threw in some washi there and there from Michaels. So you've got the little bicycles and then the rose gold foil, and then I threw in some little water trackers here and I used some check boxes that I had left over from the February monthly. So we're gonna go ahead and like I said, I didn't, I don't have much. Um, I just pulled my nap tracker, my laundry stickers, and I figured I'd lay those out. Um, May's not going to be very busy with fun things. It's just gonna be kind of busy with um, school. So let's go ahead and I've got these laundry stickers here. The laundry stickers um, are from Nash's Printwork and I will link them below. I'm just going to put that right here because I probably will wash dry and fold and then I actually don't get around to folding clothes or hanging up clothes until usually Monday. So I'm just going to put that down here and that will be every Monday I pretty much fold clothes. And then I do wanna do my little nap tracker that is from Shine, Shine Sticker Studio, I think. I always say it wrong. So I've got that laid down. Then um, the following week I grabbed these um, little bow strips from the giving girl and then I added the water trackers here and so this is how I used the pages that I showed you I decided to do the washi strip through there just to add some more color and then again we're just going to lay out the laundry hang up clothes and nap tracker and I did also I'm gonna put that right there. I did also pull this zoo day script from Sweet Bean Plans because the goal is to go to the zoo on Saturday. Now that's what I wanna do for Mother's Day and 
the Louisville Zoo actually lets mothers in for free on Mother's Day, so it's super crowded, and we have a zoo membership, so I figured we would go the day before. And then I've got my cute little Van Sticky here, and I'm just gonna put that right there for Mother's Day. Just add a little extra something, and we will do a little nap time sticker as well. And what I do for the nap time sticker, since I haven't done it in a minute, I actually just write down what times my daughter takes naps just to kind of keep track of what time she's taking her naps and how long she's sleeping. So this is how I used my plush paperies kit. And then you can see I took a box from one of the other pages and a box from the page I'm going to use next week. And then I've got this box here from one of the little mini happy planner sticker books. And again, I've got my Nash's Print Works water trackers, and I'm just laying out these here. And I will show you all everything that I had left over from um, the kits when I get done with this, just so you have an idea that I do still have, or just so you can see, I do still have a lot left, but I used a good amount. And then we will also do our little nap tracker. I guess I'll just put her right there. And then this is what is left from, or this is what I used from Design Ski. I had some heart checklist from Rose Colored Days that I threw in and some washi from, I believe, Simply Gilded. So I laid all of those out. And then again, the laundry and the nap tracker. So like I said, I will get back into doing plan with me's a little bit more later, but um, for right now, um, I just don't have the time to actually film for that long. So and we're going to do, oh, this is a little Van Sticky nap time. And I'm just going to put those down there. So here is everything that I had left over. This was the plush paperies kit. As you can see, I used a good amount of it. This was the stickers from Brandy's shop. Here's what's left. And I just kind of combined them on a page. Still got lots of these left from Crafts by Towie. Still have um, a decent amount of this left from Cactus Paper Co. I just used some of the check boxes. Um, this is all that's left from Design Ski. I used a good amount of it. Um, I actually did not use this one. Um, I don't think I used anything off of that either or off of that. So as you can tell, I've still got a good amount left of little extras that I can set aside and use later. So thank you so much for hanging out with me and I hope you have a great day. Bye.